what's up everyone in this video i will show you how to model this kind of shape building in revit okay this is called spaceship type of design okay i just choose this kind of uh, shape of building to my uh, tutorial by using the point element okay so before we go straight to the tutorial i would like to ask to everyone that please don't forget to like share or subscribe so now first thing i will do is to command units or un for the shortcut and i set this project into meters and i simply command rp just my reference line into my project okay and i just rename it to one and two okay so once you have this command rp again and place it without any name in this two side okay and pick this and mm for the shortcut to place another reference in the other side okay so once you have this okay i just simply place a point here so i just go to massing inside in place mass and I use the point element here okay so I just simply place a point one here okay, in this part okay and I just simply place a point here also one two and three okay and I simply use the arrow key to move it little bit here okay, and I just simply window it this and command mm for the shortcut to mirror it in the other side okay and go directly to spline to connect this three okay so now again window it this three and make a spline here okay and now you can go select this three point element and spline here and don't forget to make or check the reference line okay so okay and select this hold the control and shift this three okay and create this line and reference line okay, and of course you need to place or hold the control ship again and explain reference line and place a point in the middle of this one okay pick this point element okay so once you have this go to 3d okay and pick this point element to drag it like this and also this one drag it there okay and go to south so it's too high you need to adjust it by here okay okay and select this three point element and draw a spline check the reference line okay so this is the one already So now you can drag it this all the way up like this okay and you can draw it again here a reference line Okay, so once you have this, okay, I suggest you to delete this one and also this two point element here. Okay, and you can select this to select this three create form, solid form, and now you can see it's working. So if I just change this into realistic. So this is what they look already. And now you can 
select also this okay and create form solid form so if i go to south this is the angle already okay so now you can do window it everything like this and use the arrow key to move it little bit here and counter check of course in 3d okay including in the side plan okay so once you have this okay you mirror it this in the other side okay and go to 3d okay and you need to hit the tab to delete this one okay and now when you have this make a reference line okay like this and now you can place a point element again or you can select it this two point element and spline and reference line and place a point here okay take this point element make point driving modify and select this and go to south okay to drag it like this okay realistic okay and i just simply go to 3d select this tree okay hold the control shift create a form solid form okay so this is the one already and now i just go to south okay i just want to make a void in this okay choose the reference plane one and let's say i just draw a line here okay hold the control shift select this one or hit the tab okay to select only the other side drag it this the same it here okay like this okay so once you have this okay i just simply hit the tab here and you can see in the top one okay i just simply use the copy okay and go to cut select this one okay and select this cut okay you can see and now you can use the paste align to the same place and you can see automatically cut the hose or the object okay so now once you have this okay you can hit finish already okay so now once we have this okay go to massing inside wall duplicate and i just simply change this or uh, duplicate okay let's say the for example rope okay this is only the example okay go to category Ok, 
okay and go to gypsum board pick again this one and go to appearance and i just change this into blue like this okay and hit okay and i just change this into 0.5 And now I just you simply use the pick line, okay, and I just pick this wall, okay, and I simply pick this one. So now if you see the mass is in the top of the to your model, okay, so I just I don't like this kind of uh, location of my rope I just want to show you how to fix this once you encounter this okay you just hit the tab okay pick this and if you see here there is a location line so, okay so I just use the finish space in this exterior so if you see your model is in the exact or in the proper okay so now what I'm going to do next is go to cartain system okay I just simply go to create or edit type duplicate and I name this is a uh, cartain okay cartain okay so let's say one okay Keep it fixed distance, okay. And I just set this into a square, okay. And now I just simply pick this and create system, okay. So you can modify it this by picking this one okay or hit the tab or you can go into cartoon system okay edit and let's say this four and this is two hit apply okay so automatically the spacing is uh, adjust okay and you can go it also here into Mullion, okay, and choose the one in a square, and you can edit it here to change it into one. And this is point one, point one. Apply and hit, okay. So if you will see, automatically the mullions is uh, also adjusting okay and go to cartoon system if you are not happy for that you can go it and you can choose it this into three and three okay so I think this is better okay so once you have this okay go into wall again and for now I just choose the wall at the same it here okay but you can play it even in the cartridge system but for me i choose this another wall again okay and i just simply pick this okay and now you can encounter it again like this and hit the tab you just see only hit the tab to select that one and you can change it into like this okay or you can go to site okay window it all this and command mm for the shortcut to mirror in the other side okay go to 3d and you can see already Pick again this one, side, 
m m go to 3d so you can already finish your model it like this okay so you have a spaceship type of shape of building already so that is the very useful tips how to make the point element to your smooth model in Revit okay so I hope that everyone can follow the procedure how to use the point element okay so the counter check into the north okay south west okay and in this site okay so please don't forget to like share or subscribe so it's helped me out a lot and especially everyone updated once i make a video tutorial like this so see you in my next video